Hello and welcome to Sling. Assuming you've added employees, positions, and locations already, you're good to start scheduling. You can create shifts using the Create Shift button or by clicking on the plus sign that appears when you hover over the calendar grid. Adjust the time of the shift either by selecting it from the drop-down or typing it in. Add other missing details, then save. The shift that you've created just now isn't published yet, so it isn't visible to employees. You might want to hold off publishing until the whole schedule is ready, so you can keep tweaking it without anyone getting notified. Keep scheduling this way, or copy shifts via drag and drop. For that, hold the Command key on your Mac or Control key on your Windows PC and drag the shift you want to copy to a new date or employee. If you want to copy a few shifts from one day to the next, select the shifts you want to copy and pick the Copy icon from the adjacent menu. You can also create recurring shifts if employees work consistent schedules. Don't schedule too far into the future, though, as things tend to change. If you'd like your employees to sign up for shifts they want to work themselves, schedule your shifts as available and wait for applications. You'll be able to approve applicants at the end or leave shifts to be taken on a first-come, first-served basis. If you're not sure who to schedule for some shifts yet, create unassigned shifts instead. These shifts are not visible to employees and serve as reminders for shifts that need to be covered. You'll be able to drag those shifts to assign later on or make them available for employees to grab. For efficiency, you can copy entire schedules from one week to the other by using the Copy Shifts option. Now, go ahead and publish changes. Your employees will get notified of the new shift scheduled for them and will be able to see their full schedules on the phone apps or the web.